So today I'm going to go ahead and do some uh, chicken wings. I went ahead and uh, got these cut up. I got about four pounds of them. I pat dried them and then I just uh, had a towel laying over top of them for a little bit. And uh, we're going to go ahead and smoke these on the new Lexington Onyx Edition 500 smoker. I've done wings before, but hey, I want to try it out on this new uh, Pit Boss. So we're going to see how that turns out. And first thing I want to do is just go ahead and add some uh, olive oil. There's no measurement here. I just want to get it coated. I don't know what, a tablespoon or two. Get that in there real good. And then I just want to get them coated to help with the browning process as well as allow all the baking powder and salt I'm about to put on stick to it. And right here I got about, I don't know, two tablespoons of uh, baking powder, a teaspoon of salt, about a half teaspoon of pepper. And uh, we're just gonna go ahead and put it all in here. Just coat that up. And one more time, I'm just gonna rub it all in. Try to get it all coated. That baking powder on it. It's what I'm hoping will make it be like fried chicken. I've got the grill preheated to 250 degrees. Got these oiled so hopefully they don't stick too much to this. I'm just gonna start placing these on here. So I'm just going to go ahead and let that cook for about 30 minutes. That'll heat it back up to about 250 degrees. Then I'm going to crank the heat up to about 425 to kind of crisp them up a little bit. And then after that, just put them in whatever your favorite sauce is. I've got some uh, a red hot wings salsa that we're going to go ahead and, and dip them in uh, once they're done. So stick around. We'll see how these turn out here in just a short little while. Okay, back. Cheers. So, been cooking this about 30 minutes now. Let's go ahead and take a look. Man, they are looking good. Nice goldness is starting to appear to them. You can see the smoke is just coming right up, giving that nice smoke flavor to it that I like. And that you might like too. Uh, so what I'm going to do now is go ahead and crank the temperature up to 425 degrees. And basically that away 30 minutes of a nice smoke touch to these. Now we're going to go ahead and crank the temperature up. Let them get real crisp. Cook them to about 170 to 180. You know 165 is good but I want these a little crisp and then I've got some uh, red hot wing sauce. Just coat them in that. Add some celery sticks and carrots as a side, a little uh, ranch dressing, and man, it's good to go. I did some ranch dressing, just a little packet, and a little buttermilk, a little mayonnaise, and mix that in, so that's gonna be good. Uh, so if you're new here, my name is John. This is the Oki Smoking Channel. If you forget to call me John, hey, just call me Oki. Uh, enjoy making this so much. Uh, you can also find videos I have fun just putting together on TikTok. Also, there's a podcast, Oki Smoking, we started. Hey, just enjoy making content. Check us out on all those platforms. And when I come back, uh, once these are at a temperature, I'm going to show you. We're going to see what they taste like. I think they're going to be good on the pit boss. Uh, so stick around. So it's been about 15 more minutes now, and I did turn them a little bit, <clears throat> kind of moved them around some. They're definitely done. They're well above the 170 degree mark on the majority of them. It's time to take a final look. You can see some of them. Wow, look at that. Top rack. This left side on the top 
also this whole left side seems to get a little hotter but you can see I think it's because it's uh, on the south side and the winds coming from the north whether that's right or not I don't know <laughs> but uh, there you go uh, looks good I went ahead and turned the temperature down it's cooling down kind of got it uh, set it to 180 so while I get these off it's just kind of staying warm And for this, like this whole thing, you can uh, use whatever you want. If uh, there's a, any particular sauce you want, hot, mild, uh, use what you want. I'm going to go ahead and use this today. And I'm just going to pour some of this right in this bowl. Or if you don't want to add any sauce, just eat them plain. Uh, Dolores does that a lot. Um, kind of pre-season them. You could add salt, you could add a cayenne pepper, you know, in the beginning I just added salt, pepper, and baking soda. Add, add some seasonings and eat them with uh, no sauce. That's an option. So here we go. Let's take a look at that. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I got that thing clear. Look at that. I'm just going to go ahead and take this right here and drop that in. And this time, look at that, got that sauce all up on it. it smells great, I can smell it. Let me go ahead and see how this thing tastes, though. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's top notch, top notch. And this whole cook was about 45 minutes to an hour, 30 minutes, uh, 250. Turned the heat up for about 15. Flipped them here and there. Well, thanks for watching uh, once again right out here in wonderful Oklahoma. It's a beautiful day. Nothing like cooking outdoors in the backyard in the outdoor smoky, oaky smoking kitchen. I'll see you guys soon.